We're also following a state representative race in Owensboro that was decided by just one vote two years ago. State Representative Jim Glynn appears to have lost to former State Representative D.J. Johnson. Eyewitness News Mike Pickett is live in Owensboro now with the latest on this. Mike? Uh, Shelley, the apparent results from uh, tonight's race uh, this time around is definitely not the same as it was two years ago. The latest results uh, show Johnson with less than 54% of the vote and a more than 1,300 vote lead over Jim Glenn. Uh, Kentucky's uh, 13th House District represents uh, Owensboro, and this race between the same candidates was decided by one vote in 2018. If you recall, Johnson conceded before a coin flip was supposed to decide the race. Uh, he told us earlier this evening he was excited about tonight's Tonight's results. You know, this has been neck and neck for not just what since I've been in, but but for years and years. And to have a margin of victory like that really speaks to I think the message we had and the, the, the vision I have and and now it's time to go to work. And this is the third time uh, both Glenn and Johnson have faced each other. The first time was back in 2016 when Johnson beat Glenn by more than 260 votes. And Johnson also adds that if this result holds and is certified, he expects lawmakers to work on the pandemic-related issues uh, next year. But he also wants to see things done on other issues, including uh, prescription medication, medication costs and child welfare. From your local election headquarters in Owensboro, Mike Pickett, Eyewitness News.